Debbie, so what does the Apple supplier list show about the company's ongoing supply chain shift? So uh, it is very clear that uh, there have been uh, countries like uh, India and Vietnam that has made the uh, begins as uh, Ap Apple seeks to uh, uh, bring some manufacturing outside of China. And then uh, what proof this is like back in uh, 2012 when Apple first released its uh, supplier list, there was no uh, uh, manufacturer in India, but now it's got more than a dozen. So uh, that's definitely a big shift. And also with the fact that uh, India now is making uh, Apple's uh, uh, iconic iPhones, that also shows that uh, Apple is uh, aggressively uh, seeking to uh, uh, diversify its uh, manufacturing uh, hubs. And in Vietnam, case, it has seen uh, its uh, workforce in the uh, electronic sector uh, quadrupling uh, since 2012 to uh, about over uh, 1 million uh, this year. You know, China's been at the heart of this supply chain for such a long time, right? About 80 percent of these partners have a footprint there. Is that changing? Will that change more? Uh, well, uh, Apple is uh, bringing some manufacturers outside of uh, China, some of its uh, production capacity outside of China. Uh, that certainly doesn't mean that uh, uh, China's uh, status as uh, the world's factory is uh, collapsing or changing overnight. Still, I mean, we see uh, most the bulk of uh, iPhones are still being made in uh, central Chinese city of uh, Zhengzhou or what we call the uh, iPhone city. And it is just hard to uh, for uh, Apple to uh, uh, change that uh, status quo overnight. It will need time for it to build up uh, significant production capacity um, elsewhere.